Hey guys, what's up? It's Triggy here and today we are getting the Rode Video Micro Hot Shoe Microphone working with our mobile phones to capture better audio. A lot of you would have purchased this Video Micro Microphone to work primarily with your DSLR camera or other setup, uh, but then later for maybe I can connect it to my mobile phone to capture better audio with that as well. But upon connecting it, you realize, or maybe you haven't realized yet, that the audio actually isn't any better. And it's all to do with the cable which comes with the video micro. It's not a shit cable, but it's just not the right cable. Okay, this cable is what they call a TRS to TRS cable. And you can see that it's black at both ends and has two little black rings and it's not actually the cable you require. What you do require is what's on this box, or in this box, and it's a Rode SC7 TRS to TRRS patch cable. You don't have to buy the Rode one, but you have to get the right cable. You can see this side's the same, but this side is grey. That's not the defining difference here, but what is, is it has three little black rings there. So this is a cable here, and you can see close up, if in focus, that it has three little black rings on one end and the other end's the standard black. Now we're going to plug the black end in here, and in a moment I'm going to plug this end into the headphone jack of my Samsung S7 Edge. But before we do, what you're hearing right now is the built-in microphones in my Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. So the video quality, the audio quality, sorry, is fairly good because it has a good microphone or a couple of good microphones in it, in fact. But it shouldn't be anything compared to this little guy. So I'm going to plug it in now, and immediately sh you should hear better audio. It actually came up on my screen and said recording through headset. It's not the headset; it's just a headset jack. Uh, it's recording through the video micro at the moment, and if I hold that above the the camera, the phone, uh, so it's about the same distance as the built-in microphones, uh, you can hear that my dialogue is a little bit clearer, uh, a little bit crisper, um, but background audio wouldn't be getting picked up as much. I don't have any background audio at the moment, but um, but if I did you should be hearing my dialogue a lot clearer over that um, because this is a directional microphone, not omnidirectional. You can get a, another model similar to this, but it's circular and captures audio in a 360 degree uh, environment. So if we face it away from me, you are probably hearing a distance voice uh, as if I'm not talking directly into the microphone, of course. So that proves that the audio is much better when using the TRS to TRRS cable. Now, I've just unplugged it and you're hearing the audio out of my Samsung S7 Edge again, but to make this completely conclusive, I'm going to plug in the original cable again into this microphone and now I'm going to plug it into the side of my phone, the headphone jack, or headset jack, and you, it probably sounds no different after being plugged in, and that's because you're actually hearing my voice as it's recorded through my Galaxy S7 Edge still. So it hasn't actually detected the microphone being plugged in, and I know that for sure because no little status message came up on the screen saying recording from headset. So that pretty much sums thing, things up, guys. Um, please subscribe, like, ask any questions below. But this, just to show you again, is the cable you need, the TRS to TRRS patch cable. They're about uh, $25 recommended retail from memory, but you can actually get them for about $10 to $15 off of eBay or any of the online stores that you're... Um, that you're savvy to, um, so don't get ripped off. Uh, you probably don't even need to buy a road branded one, but as long as it's TRS to TRRS, or just look for the difference between the two. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Take it easy. Ciao.